Black Smile Story. This is really happening. She is really here. Lauren, 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 Lauren. We got Lauren Patton to my left, and we got Doves Weinblad to my right, and we are on the red carpet for a very exciting show that is coming up that Doves is going to tell us a little bit more about. The show is called Thank You For Coming Out, and it features LGBTQ performers of all levels from all over New York City. Um, we do improv and musical improv based on the personal coming out stories of our storyteller. Which is me. <laughs> right here. So right now we are going to collect their hashtag smile stories and find out just what makes them smile. Okay, so listen, truth right here. Um, I'm a major cat lady. I have a cat. His name is Snug the Joiner. And what makes me smile is when we wake up in the morning and it's a sunny day outside and I let him out of my balcony and he freaks out every time because it's a new experience for him every single time. And I have joy through my cat's eyes. That's real. I'm Lauren Patton, and I'm a cat lady. And I feel like your cat is probably a Lauren Patton lady. I think so. Or a Lauren Patton. I like to think Cat so. Yes. Yeah. Catton? Oh, <gasps> hashtag Catton. <laughs> oh my god, please make that a hashtag. I will, please. So everyone in this room, and everyone that's going to see this, maybe they'll they'll jump on that trend. Yeah, yeah. What makes you smile, Dubs? <sighs> this show makes me smile. Bringing people together from all levels, from all over the community, I just itch my nose. Um, it makes me smile because thanks. You're welcome. Because it's such a special show. It's so supportive and inclusive, and it's amazing. And thank you guys for sharing your smile with New York City Smile for Me. And I think I can safely say that all of us kind of want to change our majors to Lauren and Debs. So thanks, guys. <laughs> What happened last night? Are you really here? Joan, 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 Joan. Hi, Joan! Don't wake up, Joan! Oh my god, last night. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Last night. I got so excited, I was too enthusiastic. Thank you for not laughing. Well, you laughed a little bit at one point when I was touching you and said I might lose consciousness, which you said was adorable, and I just have to trust that you don't think I'm an idiot or some kind of an animal. I never lost control due to overwhelming lust, but I must say that I'm changing my major to Joan. I'm changing my major to sex with Joan. I'm changing my major to sex with Joan with a minor in kissing Joan. For in study to Joan's inner thighs, a seminar on Joan's ass and her Levi's, and Joan's crazy brown eyes. Joan, I feel like Hercules, oh God, that sounds ridiculous. Just keep on sleeping through this and I'll work on calming down. So by the time you've woken up, I'll be cool, I'll be collected, and I'll have found some dignity. But who needs dignity? Because this is so much better. I'm radiating happiness. Will you stay here with me for the rest of the semester? We won't need any food. We'll live on sex alone. on Joan. It's a cutting edge field and my mind is blown. I would gladly stay up every night to hone my compulsory skills with Joan. I will study my way down her spine, familiarize myself with her someone new. Nothing I just did is anything I would do. Overnight, everything changed. I am not prepared. I'm dizzy, I'm nauseous, I'm shaky. I'm scared. Am I falling into nothingness or flying into something so sublime?
Let's never leave this room. How about we stay here until finals? I'll go to school forever. I'll take out a dementedly huge high interest loan. <laughs> <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.